Hi guys, how are you? Today's video is going to be a video per request and this is another video on my Max collection and today I'm going to show you the pigments that I have and the swatches for them. I have a couple of videos on my channel already and those are videos for my Max lipstick, lip gloss, blush and eyeshadow collections. So today's video is a breakdown of my pigments. So if you're interested to see my pigment collection and the swatches, stay tuned. Thank you. Also, if I have time, I'll include the MAX glitters. And if I don't, I'll just make a separate video on the glitters. So if you're interested to see the collection, stay tuned. Thanks. So I'm going to begin by reviewing a very, very special set of pigments. And these are crushed metal pigments that came out with Spring Forecast Collection in the fall of 09. These are my all-time favorites, and I really do hope that MAC re-releases um, those sometime. But let me just go ahead and show you the swatches. So I'm going to begin by reviewing the Crushed Metal Pigments Stacked 1. I'm sorry, Stacked 2. And there's four uh, metal pigment colors. So the first one is a very, very beautiful gold. Look how gorgeous this is. And this is the dry swatch. It's just dry on my hand without any base for the color, color that I just showed. The second color in the stack looks like dirty olive gold. It's so pretty also. And the swatch for that is this one right here. These are some amazing quality products. This is why I love MAC. I mean, um, latest collections have not been so good to me, but this collection right here is why I just love Max Pigments. The third color in the stack is this uh, rose gold pigment. This is a swatch for it. It's also very, very, very gorgeous and super shimmery and super metallic. The last color from this tower is this orangish gold pigment. And this is the swatch right here. Again, super pigmented, super metallic, super shimmery, gorgeous. I love those. Next review is for Stacked One collection. And these are purples and purple pinks. And they, they are gorgeous also. The first color is this unbelievably beautiful metallic pink. And this is a swatch for it right here. It could be worn on your cheeks, it could be worn on your lips, on your eyes, amazing color. Second color is Metallic Lavender. And this is one of my favorite pigments of all times. This is a swatch for it right here. It's dry, it's obviously a lot more pigmented when it's wet. This is one amazing color. Third color is this beautiful, stunning metallic fuchsia pigment. <clears throat> and this pigment has gold pearl in it. It's also very, very beautiful. It's breathtaking. And the last color of this collection is this insanely gorgeous deep eggplant metallic pigment. Here's a swatch for it, and this is one of my all-time favorites. It's just beautiful. Next pigment is called Dark Soul, and Dark Soul is this medium black or very dark gray with silver pearl. This pigment is very, very beautiful, and this is one of the pigments that I really suggest um, owning. This is perfect for smoky eye or, you know, when you want to um, smoke out the under... the bottom lash line. It's just gorgeous. Next pigment is called Frozen White and this is a white pigment with duochrome uh, purple or violet in it or even lavender. This is the swatch right here. This is also a very very beautiful pigment and it's great for a smoky eye. And it looks very very different and much more pigmented when it's wet. Next pigment is Gorgeous Platinum and it is what it is. It's just a platinum color. Um, but it's like platinum pewter to me. 
It's very subtle and it doesn't have any glitter or shimmer. Also very good for a um, neutral smoky eye or a light smoky eye. Here's beautiful golden olive. It's just a very, very light golden green color. Very beautiful too. Next pigment is called Revved Up and it's a reddish plum color. It's a pearly color. Very beautiful. I love doing a smoky eye with this color. It just makes uh, makeup look completely different. Beautiful color. Burnt Burgundy is a matte pigment and I also love it. I actually mix it with Revved Up when I do a smoky eye. I mix this too and they turn out beautiful but this is the swatch for Burnt Burgundy right here. Next pigment is something that I cannot live without. This is called Vanilla and this is a perfect perfect highlighter. It's a white gold color. Absolutely gorgeous, shimmery, light, very beautiful and I recommend this color to everybody. This is the perfect highlight. Next pigment is also very beautiful. It's called White Gold. But when you look at the swatch and when you actually apply it, it's not really white. It has a like teal duochrome and it's very very pretty. Also it could be a perfect highlight. Next pigment is also very beautiful. It's called Rose Gold and it's a very very dirty gold color. This is a swatch. It's also very beautiful for smoky eye. Next pigment is beautiful Heritage Rouge and it's kind of like a purple plum color beautiful as well. All of this by the way are dry. This is how highly pigmented they are. There is no base on my hand either. Push the edges is insanely beautiful bright 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 purple and this one is um, semi matte. It has some pearl on it but it has a weird texture of uh, matte with a pearl but gorgeous. Next pigment is called Pastoral and uh, it's very 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 light pearly green. Very light. You can barely see it but it's beautiful. Next pigment is called Province and Province is a matte white gold with gold pearl. I also love this color. In texture it reminds me of a lot of Bobbi Brown eyeshadows. It's a beautiful beautiful color. Circa Plum is a light metallic plum color. Here's a swatch for it right here. Very light. Here's violet pigment. It's very very pretty. Also on the lighter side but very pretty violet color. Marine Ultra is bright bright blue but it's matte and I'm having a hard time using it. Here's a swatch for it. It's, it's actually pretty sheer and very very matte. Here's Milk that came out with Hello Kitty. Here's a swatch for Milk. Golden Olive is one of my most favorite colors of all times. And here's a swatch for it. Golden Olive. Coco Motion is another dirty gold um, brownish color but it's lighter than the previous one. And here's a swatch for it. Here is Lovely Lily. It's a light lily color. Very pretty. Jardine Airs is a pinkish gold color. It reminds me a little bit of Melon but a lot lighter. I'm going to swatch Melon right next to it. Jardine Airs right here. Here is Melon. It's um, golden pink also or golden peach. It has a lot more gold than the previous pigment. This is melon right here. Next color is deep blue green. It's also uh, from Hello Kitty collection and it's a blue green pigment and it is insanely gorgeous. Next is one of the most beautiful pigments of all times and this is Teal by MAC. And here's a swatch of teal. And I'm a sucker for teals. Here's a beautiful color polished ivory. It's completely matte and it's kind of like a see this is the swatch right here and it reminds me of, like of a bone color or something. I don't know. It's white matte color. Next color is air de blue 
and it is also very 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 gorgeous baby blue color right here next color is beautiful it's called grape it's a very 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 bright purple next color is one of my favorites it's called fairy light it doesn't look anything significant in the packaging but in swatch it's white with pink duochrome and it's matte so it's very pretty next color is also very beautiful it's called antique green and here's a swatch for it beautiful brownish plum color called bloodline from fabulous felines equally beautiful color called gold stroke there's a swatch for that color lithe by the way if I'm not pronouncing the colors right I'll list all the colors in the information bar below but here's the swatch for beautiful lithe gorgeous color movement this is it right here Alice and Olivia collection pigment partylicious Here's a swatch for beautiful teal partylicious. Here's pigment universal mix. It's kind of a white golden color. Here it is right here. Alice and Olivia pigment called later. It's black and purple. Here's a swatch for it right here later. Here's golden brown pigment called the Family Crest. And the swatch is right here. Also very, very gorgeous. Here's beautiful brown with pearl. It's called Rich Life. And here it is in the swatch. This pigment is also one of my most favorite. And this is called Moonlight Night. And here's Moonlight Night. It's mind blowing. It's beautiful. Here's beautiful if it sparkles. There's a swatch for it. I use it as a highlight on my cheeks, you guys, and it works wonders. Here's beautiful pigment naked. It's a very, very gorgeous naked matte pigment with pearl. This is helium and it reminds me of milk actually. It's same white pink helium. This color is beautiful sunny days. Here's the swatch for it. Here's equally gorgeous copper eyes. Here's a swatch for that. This is beautiful chocolate brown. And here's a swatch for that. Here's Museum Bronze. It's a beautiful bronze, like golden bronze color. Cheers, my baby. It's this pink one right here. Beautiful Silver Fog. It's right here. It's a gorgeous color. Gorgeous Soft Wash Gray. There's a swatch for it. It's bluish gray color. Gold Mode. beautiful most darling there's a swatch for that it's a matte pigment with pearl or with glitter gift of glamour it's a pinkish gold color right here and finally beautiful gilded green and here's a swatch for that it's very 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 light so this concludes my review of the pigments that I have or the ones that I could find at the moment and I didn't have enough time to put glitters in the video but I'm going to make a separate video on the glitter collection from MAC that I have and how I use them and what I use to keep them in place and stuff like that. So I hope you like you guys like this video. Please leave me your comments, um, comment, rate and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much. See you later. Bye bye.